Hey -o, Omni Dogs and Omni Kittens. It's Omni Dog here. Thanks for tuning in. Today I am going to try to piece together and convince you to get the Astro City Metro Book number two. Uh, this now what I have are the standard books that have been released for quite a few years and you can see how crazy it is with the spines uh, vertigo re-released this wild storm homage homage so it this has gone through a lot of if you have a non-conforming spine disorder then you're not going to like these versions but a lot of them are out of print and that's the point really is that a lot of these standard editions are out of print and now the metro book series gives you a chance to read one of the all-time best uh superhero stories with a multitude of superheroes and regular people written in the most imaginative imaginative grounded in reality almost way. Uh, Astro City Metro Book 2 contains volume 2, 13 through 22, and 13 is the last story in Family Album. And it's one of my favorites because I, this just shows how great Kurt Busiek's imagination is. Because... This is a story about how a cartoon character actually comes to life stepping off the screen due to a villain back in the 40s uh, inventing some kind of ray, that a belief ray, that if you believed enough in the character, he would step out of the screen. And so we've got this Leo the Lion interact as a cartoon interacting with regular people here's where he uh, became sentient and climbed out of the movie theater and it details what he goes through being a hollywood star as a cartoon character come to life and it is one of the most imaginative as I, i'm tripping over that word it's it's just an incredibly well written story um about what this poor lion goes through. His peaks and valleys as a Hollywood star, kids' TV shows, movies, uh, you know, then he hits the bottom, and it's just a wonderfully imaginative story. So that's number 13 that starts out the book. And I should give a recognition to organic priced books. Go there, $2 off with the code OmniDog. And here's the big savings, 5% off shipping three or more books together with code OmniDog, ship it together. Right on. So then after that, this is a story called Tarnished Angel and it contains Let's see. I believe it contains doo, 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 volume two. Okay, fourteen through twenty. So it's basically the whole book, and uh, this involves. This is a uh, one of the most wonderful stories. It, it's based on Robert Mitchum's face. He's called Steel Jack, and he's a villain that's got just gotten out of prison, and he's trying to live the straight life. But his body's made of metal. How is he going to be able to go straight in a city that wants him to keep breaking the law? Uh, it, it is a heartfelt, touching, wonderful story about how he's trying to turn his life around, and in the part of Astro City where he has settled, uh, some people, a lot of people are being murdered. And so that gives him purpose and that gives him 
uh, a way to not break the law, but to try and help solve the crimes. And this steel jack book is just wonderful. And it's uh, heartbreaking. It's beautiful. It tugs at all the right emotional strings. And I think you'd really dig it. And there are other stories in here too. There's the Conquistador. And the thing about these Astro City stories, like Tarnished Angel ran for a few issues. And these stories are generally standalone. So they there's you can always just dip into Astro City and either read the issues that you want or the single story that you want. The, they're generally standalone stories. I, I definitely recommend starting from the beginning and reading it all the way through. But these are some more stories involving Steeljack. And they're really wonderful. So it contains this entire book, Tarnished Angel. And let's see, then, <laughs> and it'll be in a paperback, a, a standard size paperback, but the mapping will be much different than what I'm showing you. Like they're, even though they're taking this entire story, Tarnished Angel, they're going to take, this is Local Heroes. This will also be in the Metro book number two. Look at this. This is so cool. Um, it includes 21 through 22 from volume two. So there you've got 13 through 22 all mapped together, probably. Local Heroes one through five. Astro City Special number one. Uh, the 9-11 Tribute, uh, World's Finest Comic Books, and Writers and Artists Tell Stories to Remember. And so this whole book will be in there as well. 13 through 22, yeah, 21 through 22. Uh, the art is great, the stories are great, they're they're genuinely moving stories, and the art is perfect for this, with uh, covers by Alex Ross. This is Brent Anderson doing the, the issues, and I'm just going to be quiet and show you the art. And as you can see, there's a lot of interaction with the supers with the local populace in Astro City. So as I mentioned, the mapping is much different than what I've I've got. I can I can deal with it, but it'll be a lot easier for you because then in this book, <laughs> it takes the visitor's guide and it skips all this stuff right here. And I assume that's gonna be in Metro Book Three. This is the visitor's guide to Astro City, which is the last thing that's going to be collected in Metro Book number two. Uh, it's really a, a cool visitor's guide that talks about many of the heroes and how they fit into Astro City, what they accomplish, what they do. And it's really cool. Winged Victory, Enforce, Nightingale and Sunbird. You can see that a lot of them are homages to uh, Marvel DC classic characters, modern and older. And it that's where it ends with the Astro City Victory. Uh, sorry, that says... Uh, visitor's Guide. 
So I highly, highly encourage you, please, to get Astro City. This is the perfect time to jump on it because these books have been hard to find out of print through various publishers. And now Kurt Busiek and Brent Anderson are running it through Image. And you'll be able to finally get the proper mapping, very interesting mapping. You'll be able to get the proper mapping and get a great reading experience. Uh, Astro City is the perfect blend of characters that you see. You can follow the characters throughout the book. Even though they're standalone stories, some of the characters you see more than others, and you can see, you know, character growth. You can find out something about them. And they're, they have, some have relationships with each, each other. Uh, some, and then the, the villains aren't necessarily all evil, as in Steel Jack. He wants to turn straight. His body's made out of steel. Who's going to hire him? What's he going to do? Uh, so you get a little sympathetic riff on some of the villains and how Astro City, the books, uh, weave in and out of the populace, the general populace of Astro City. This is stuff from book one. Let me show you Tarnished Angel because this is what's going to be in book two. Uh, so it's it's deeply moving, deeply interesting, and extremely well written. This is I don't I have a hard time trying to decide what my favorite Kurt Busiek book is. Uh, probably Marvels, but then I turn around and think about Astro City and Aerosmith and a bunch of others. And Kurt Busiek is just one of my all-time favorite writers. So please pick up Astro City Metro Book 2. I think Metro Book 3 is coming out. This is October, the end of October 2022. I think within the next three to four months, Me Metro Book 3 is coming out. And you don't necessarily need to wait for all of them to come out to read them. Since they are standalone stories, they don't end on cliffhangers. Uh, they can be one issue or five issues. And they are exactly what comic books should be. Entertaining, smart comics that will keep you engaged. And they're fun. Which is the whole point. So, thank you for watching. Omni Dog here. Peace and love. Peace and love. Appreciate your taking the time to watch this. Uh, please like the video and subscribe. And leave, feel free to leave me messages. I love getting messages from my viewers and getting in conversations, learning more about you, getting your suggestions, getting your ideas. And of course, you guys always worry about my health, which uh, I touches me to no end. That is just so nice and i have such a great relationship with my viewers i genuinely appreciate it and organic prize books two dollars off with code omnidog and five percent off with code five percent off shipping three or more books together with omnidog ship it together so i have the greatest viewers ever you guys are wonderful thanks for tuning in get astro city metro book number two, and you're on your way to collecting one of the most fun comics ever written. That's right. I said it. Ever. Peace and love. Peace and love.